The Denver Nuggets blew a 20 point lead. Ironic. Oh. Next question, man. <laughs> the season's over. That's what's hard. Oh! Over, it's hard. Oh, boo hoo! If the top two player is that American, we do not care! We're done with the foreigners! We're going to move on to the last series, what some of y'all might call the main event. Ladies and gentlemen. Dead people. <laughs> Nah, no way you actually had a nugget. <laughs> <laughs> this is Say Yoki. <laughs> now this dude is nasty. <laughs> the Denver Nuggets blew a 20 point lead. Ironic. God. Blew a 20 point lead at home. Minnesota rallies uh, specifically in the second half to beat. The Denver Nuggets at home, 99 to 90. First of all, holding Denver to 90 points is crazy work. By the way, that holding honestly holding any team under 100 is crazy work to me. But specifically the Nuggets to 90, is it? bro, they're just Laker merchants. They're I mean, just, some people just Laker merchants. Some people will tell you that the NBA is on pace for people to just score every possession, even in the playoffs. So, where was defense? Was defense right? Oh yeah! Hey, the pod day Thursday is gonna be a day. Oh yeah, Thir Thursday! Hey, hey, turn on your notifications. Thursday is gonna be a banger. Trust and believe that. Yeah, Friday morning as well, for the audio side. Oh, yeah, but um, <laughs> yeah, man, the the Timberwolves <laughs> beat the Nuggets. I think this is a win for NBA fans across the world. Dark Magic has been defeated. NBA yes! stands for niggas balling again. I repeat, NBA stands for niggas balling again. We don't. There was only one euro left, and it's the goat. Yeah, say so it, bro. Right. Say it. Say it. What does it stand for? They're balling again. <laughs> yes. Yes. Back to normalcy, man. God. <laughs> Fuck hey, the Zach Eady guy. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Um, um, I hey, take the floor, man. Me. Take the floor, bro. Uh, you don't want me to do that, man, because uh, <laughs> I'm not gonna stop. You're gonna have to kick me because I'm not gonna lie. I told you, niggas, they're just Jamal Murray is a 2024 light skinned Canadian. We do not care that that shit was gonna get exposed. Meet the Nuggets, nigga. You lied about your clutch shots, you lied about your full post fade, you lied about your handoffs, you lied about your handling ability, you lied about that dog, and you lied about a ton of things. You lied about your half court shot, you lied about it. Go, you go, go, go battle with yourself, nigga, in Canada. Go, go talk to Drizzy because we don't need you over there. We don't even know that. Porter? Porter? Oh, man. I, I could have said something fucked up just now. But I'm going to just say, hey, 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 Porter, you, you, you go you you go get your family shit straight. Your family, actually, you you, you gonna handle that. <laughs> you you gonna handle that. Um, Everyone else, before I get to Mikey and Yoker, before I get to Mikey and the Yoker, everybody else, where was you at? I thought this team was deep as shit. I thought the team would deep as fuck. Where, where, Y'all had the AG game, the KC3 game. I thought that, I thought this team in the underrated bench of the Denver Nuggets. What, what the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? Why are we looking at the T-Wolves like they got one, two, three, four, five plus nines? Like, why, why, why are we looking at the T-Wolves like they going to smack them niggas up because they got a deep ass team? But, 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 but the Denver shit. But, 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 but Denver. But, the, but, my, did this one, Jokic? This is about uh, Peyton. Like, this one, this one, uh, uh, Braun, AG. No, nah, this really AG, because if it ain't a dunk, you ain't got shit, bum-ass nigga. <laughs> and now let me get to that fraud MVP. Oh, my Lord. Um, Hey, I give him this. He does raise a trophy every season. You know what? Prime Jokic will raise a trophy every season. Now, is it a ring? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> hey, but the trophy on it will say MVP for sure. You will raise an MVP trophy every year. That's a fact. That's not opinion. That's a fact. However, um, you, you let Goger hit a turnaround? <laughs> Go back. Hell, you like yeah. to go better, buddy. You like it. You <laughs> like it. We love it. 
you you let go bear hit a turnaround. And then I ain't gonna lie, the rest was on your ping. Followed up my man Cat. And everybody sent or about to follow up my man Cat. And Nas Reed goes to the floor. <laughs> this nigga Nas Reed solo squad. He just solo squad in Denver. Before Damo goes, oh. before before you go, because I I do want the fan, final stage for you. Um I go live. I feel like the conversation for me is truly about the Minnesota Timberwolves and the ass beating that they that they give to the Nuggets. I understand it went to seven, but the way we were talking about the Nuggets going into these playoffs, and that's that's all of us. I feel like at least when we talked about the Western Conference, this team looked unstoppable, and for the Minnesota Timberwolves to whoop ass and truly make them look human, that is a crazy feat. And busting their ass for a lot of the series, not Game Seven, but for a lot of the series. Was crazy. Jaden McDaniel stepping up and clamping the fuck out of playoff Dark Magic Murray. Oh my god, that was beautiful. That was beautiful. MPJ looking like I don't I don't you looking like MPJ on a bad day. I don't know, man. <laughs> he look he looked like how he normally looks. They are Laker merchants. I keep trying to tell y'all. They 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 only do this shit in LA. They only beat up on the old niggas. <laughs> they can only beat up on the old niggas like my man Braun. And by the way, Malone, oh my God. I'm gonna let Damo go and I'm gonna spin the block on it. I got a lot of shit to say about that nigga. But that what that nigga said at the press conference, lame as fuck. Oh I believe Lord. we have we do have the oh clip ready. Yeah, Sage, you, you can bring it up right now. It should, it should be timestamp. Yeah, Damo, right. you starting after this, bro. Swear to God. But this is Lame as hell, boy. Oh, fuck ass no, bro. Y'all be sitting there justifying this goober. My lord. <laughs> that is a conversation why uh, I do want to have today is why the Nuggets are so hated. Right? For you guys after you went up 20. In the second. Go to 329. 329. Uh, or often. I believe. They doubled Nicola. I felt a lot of those were, were good looks. It can go down. And uh, I know, you know sometimes you oversimplification of the NBA being a maker included, but it wasn't the only one. We as a team did right not make enough shots. It was at the beginning. If you were talking about if you were talking about the one that went viral, it was at the beginning. Okay, bad. The NBA okay, being a maker bad, miss league. What changed defensively for you guys after you went up twenty in the second half? Uh, our offense. Do you feel like there was anything that you guys got away from offensively in that stretch after you reached that point? I'll have to go back and watch the film. Oh, I thought it was at the beginning. How hard is it just to absorb a loss? Oh, I, think, I think this is it, yeah. Going ahead by 20. Now, let's just absorb the pain. <laughs> Fuck it. Next question, man. <laughs> the season's over. That's what's hard. Being up 20. The season's over. Oh! Oh! Over. It's hard. Oh, boo hoo. Boo hoo. Oh, yeah, he called it stupid, by the way. Boo fucking who. Oh, my. Damo, your floor is yours. Yeah, go ahead, man. I didn't, I didn't realize you could hear them celebrate in the back, but um, first things first to just start everything off. Baby, I need to know you're exciting. <laughs> and you're this shit. <laughs> Sorry, just gotta get that out there because boy, oh boy, was that nigga Swiper talking so crazy after the Nuggets beat the Lakers everyone. last year. Not just and the Lakers, man. on everyone. Yes. The, the elitist mindset that nigga got after one ring is disgusting. It reminds me why I'm so arrogant as a Laker fan because the moment you little peak, pipsqueak franchises get one ring, you niggas get insufferable. Man. Anyway, um, listen, I'm not about to sit here and get animated, get hype, and do all this hooting and hollering. Um, I, I'm going to save that for everybody else. It's because, I mean, what do we expect? Let me ask. When Jokic wins MVPs, he gets knocked out of the playoffs, right? Yeah, <laughs> you raise a trophy. I'm, 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 I'm confused. Another thing, everybody told me all year how bad the Lakers were. Everyone going into the playoffs, you're delusional for thinking the Lakers can do anything. The Lakers suck. The Lakers suck. Well, the Lakers suck, and these niggas were constantly, constantly getting in tough battles with the Lakers. The fuck does that mean to them? What does that make them? So, really, I'm thinking about it. And there's no need to run victory laps 
Because they are who we thought they were. Thank you. They are who we thought they were. Laker merchants, front runners, fake underdogs. Who never face a 50-win team. Yes. Man. Man. Seven and eight seed? Come on, dog. The propaganda pushes itself. Tell me this. When they win cha- when they won a championship, who did they get through? The Minnesota Timberwolves without J Mac and uh Nazareth. Uh, uh a freshly put together Sun Squad. Like with, uh, with, with Chris KD. Paul was there. Yeah, no no Chris Paul. It was K D Book and Friends. That, that's who it was. K D Book and the Troop. That and then they ran the us in the conference finals. And in another a series team. where God. a playing team where it was mad close games and they just squeaked on by. And we're surprised a real defense gave them problems. We're surprised that the dark magic disappeared magically. We're surprised that the Tobias Harris of fucking Carmelo's turned into the Tobias Harris of Carmelo's when he played a team that was actually serious. Because we, let's be honest, AD might have been serious. LeBron might have been serious. The Lakers weren't a serious team because Darvin Ham was coaching. But when you have a serious team with a coach, that even, even with a torn meniscus, didn't want to put his hands in his pockets. Niggas was shook. He ain't him, he ain't him, he ain't him. But the, I just, but, but the, but the, but the Vorp and PER, Jokic, we're not slow. You're a fraud, buddy. <laughs> Y'all got, and, and you know what's crazy? Their season ended the exact way it was supposed to. Uh, a baguette beyond both. Matter of fact, I'm not going to disrespect that man. A Rudy Gobert turn around fade off one foot sky arching shot goes in. That was the dagger. That was yeah. the shot. That, that was the nail in the coffin when he did that. Man, oh man, I have not been more happy for a team. I might get up and start shaking ass again. I have not been more happy for a team to just get there well-deserved Kermuffets. I don't even know if I said that right. Fuck it. I don't care. They got what they deserve. The niggas are they're a bunch of they're a bunch of fans. They're not like us for real because they're Canadians and, and foreigners and, 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 and family of degenerates. Yeah, I'm going sh- yeah, all Gilbert. All arenas. Yeah. Yeah. And they ended off and they ended off just just and say you got it after this. Shout out to the Americans because we we show them we run this bitch again. Three of the four teams in the conference finals best player I am is a citizen. A American citizen that came up through the structure of AAU. No more of these NBA Academy bastards. No more of these. I've been playing pro since I was 13. Slovenian, Slovakian, Serbian, whoever's. Straight, I am a real. Even Luka Doncic need a real nigga by his side to succeed. We ain't seen Luka here since the last time he had a real nigga, Jalen Brunson. I am a real American. I might not fuck with Hulk Hogan, but the slogan burns bright and true. I have the rights of every man. Shout out my niggas, man. Yeah. Go ahead, take I, I honestly forgot. That was so brilliant. I forgot what I was going to say. Um, I just, man, I just think that, like, you niggas are such Laker merchants. Y'all retort to everything is, so what the Lakers do? How about, how about, how about, how about you? Hey, we can play you one-on-one in Cancun. <laughs> how about that? We'll play you one-on-one in Cancun. Uh, you, you probably won't have Jokic. She's probably riding a horse or some dumb shit. But, yeah, yeah, you're, you're, you thought she was raising a trophy this year. <laughs> you, you thought she was raising a, a dynasty. You thought, hey, didn't 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 when y'all sitting there talking about Lil Yo top 10, 5, 2 all time, some shit. Oh man, not this year. Oh man, <laughs> dang it. Womps, rats. Yeah, nigga, you're out. You lost to an ant. <laughs> <laughs> I almost I almost said something great. Hey man, I gotta buy gotta hey too. I don't even know if I can say what I was going to say on YouTube. But anyway. I, I, th- I think we've already touched on some of these uh, talking points, but I do want to ask y'all because I made a video about this today because I understand we're smoking pack right now, but the Denver Nuggets are a team that drafted their core. They are a team that, you know, built through the draft. Um, 
in my opinion, play the right way, a uh, 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 small market team. Why? What makes the Denver Nuggets so hated, in y'all opinion? Like, why? Why is the vitriol oh, can, this bad? I can tell you why. I can oh, tell you why. Oh, oh easy, God. easy. It's because they don't have a top two player that's doing this. <laughs> Top two player is the American. We do not care. We're done with the foreigners. We're done with the Canadians. You need an American as your one and two, not three, not four, not five. No Aaron Gordon. No Andy Chetty. No Shays. No Burks. Only Ants. Hey, my mom's first. Yeah, Tatum's. Tatum's. Jimmy Brown. Yeah, Derek White. You are so bad, baby. Yeah. Tell him no one sucks. America wants this again. That's why. That's why they're still hated because they're not American. Oh, no, I, I hate the way that they walk, the way that they talk. I hate the way that they dress. I hate the way that they make threes. Sometimes they need a contest. I hate these niggas. And the thing is, the thing is, they'll do all of that bullshit. I even hate when they say they're underdogs. But that's just me, I guess. Because I swear, they always think that nigga. They always think they're the underdog. These dumbass niggas in this chat today. But, 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 but people, the, the Lakers were favored against the Nuggets. Who? Oh, 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 me? No. <laughs> you count my opinion? Nigga, <laughs> I bleed purple and gold. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> but, just, but you niggas are so dumb, delusional, and like pussy that you need some underdogs, underdog shit to, to, to fall back on. And then when you do some, you want to talk all this bullshit. Bro, you, you're the favorite. And you fucking flopped. You fucking suck. You couldn't hit your clutch shots. You couldn't even hit your open shots. Maybe if there was purple and gold on that court, you would have done something. I'm, I think you're palm tree merchants. Because I don't think you beat a real finals team, but you beat Miami. Palm uh, tree no palm tree. And let, me, and, and let me say right now, let me say right now palm to the YouTube commenter <laughs> that's typing away right now. Oh, oh my God. That's so xenophobic. Oh, oh my God. Oh, jeez. You guys want to replace CNT? Oh, jeez. This is so unprofessional. Oh, jeez. This is so mean. Oh, jeez. Shut up. Shut up, man. <laughs> I do not care. I don't give a... Hey, game is game, pussy. Remember that. <laughs> game is game. Morty, it's not xenophobic, Morty. <clears throat> the nuggets just suck, Morty. <laughs> Sometimes, Morty, <clears throat> when, when someone bites your dick, Morty, <laughs> you got to slap on the face. <laughs> And if it sounds racist, Morty, it's probably not. <laughs> <laughs> At least for me, all right, I'm, I'm going to give us, <laughs> Jesus Christ, I'm going to give a semi, semi-serious semi answer. And, and y'all truly did touch on, like, a, a, a lot of the things that I said in the video. I feel like people do not like what the Denver Nuggets and Jokic stood for, for from so many different angles. I can't really point to one reason, but in terms of Jokic being... Uh, this advanced analytics, like, he, when you think of advanced analytics, you immediately think of Jokic. And a lot of people don't like that. When you talk about the um, the European invasion, a lot of people don't like that. And a lot of people were waiting for an American to dominate the sport again. So that, <laughs> that, that, is, that is a part of it as well. I also think a big portion of NBA fans are LeBron, Warriors, and Celtics fans. And uh, this team specifically has been busting our ass the last two years. So, uh, last, yeah, la last two years. So, that's a part of it as well. Um, also, I said this in my video. Has there ever been a cockier coach than Mike Malone? No, bro. Mike Malone's, a, Mike Malone's like, and I ain't gonna lie. If he was a Laker coach, I'd love him. Bro, that nigga talk shit. And y'all act like he doesn't. That nigga talks hella shit, bro. Yeah, so it's just this this Denver Nuggets team. And also, oh, I forgot to add this. I think Jokic was creeping up into some very uncomfortable conversations that people did not want to have. And I do think him being stopped from this back-to-back -back MVP, like what y'all did, stopped a lot of those conversations. Hey, we got we to wait till next year. We got to wait till next year.